it's camping weekend we are at big lake state park in missouri i am currently working up some dinner because it's like i don't even know what time 5 5 30 maybe something like that in the evening we're going to be here for the weekend hopefully going to get to do some kayaking darby is obviously thirsty she always waits until i hit that record button you notice that um i we are gonna go hopefully go out and go kayaking on this lake i'm wanting to go down and check it out we'll at least show you around show you the campsite campground and the lake and maybe take you on a little kayaking trip and uh gonna meet up with uh, our daughter this weekend and she's she's gonna hang out with us a little bit and we're gonna do a little cookout while we're here so hopefully you can join us for all of that pretty nice campground um, so I guess this middle row, what about that row over there? So are they not renting any of this from here over? Because they are doing improvements. So when I went to do online reservations and it showed that they were all, you know, rented or whatever, it is not because they were actually full. It's because... They haven't closed off. But it's actually more shaded than what the website said, so that's cool. I like that. Oh, they're oh, those are the non-electric ones down there. Oh. We'll be down there in a second. There's a playground and a shower house. And I'm guessing that's a dump station or something over there. There's the dumpsters. So when we need to dump some trash. Future campground upgrades. Now this state park, what year was that, baby? 2019? Was it 19? It wasn't 20. 20 was the COVID thing. Uh, so maybe 19? Somewhere in that area. 2018 2019 this campground flooded out and I guess it caused a whole bunch of damage and I believe it was closed until last year closed completely I think last year may have been the first year it reopened of course you know 2020 being in there it may have been closed for that because I think they did shut our state parks down a little for a little while because I remember when we went to the Graham Cave State Park, we were all like, woohoo, they're open again. So over there, those are all non-electric sites. And I think those are awesome sites. And they were supposed to be booked too. So, and they, I mean, you can see they're marked red. Well, that one is, those aren't. Of course, I probably wouldn't have done it because it's so hot. There is a good, really good breeze right now, but it's probably upper 80s temperature wise. I'm just gonna kinda, I know somebody, this is somebody's site, but they're not here yet, so it's okay. Well, I'll be either way. I just wanna show everyone the pretty lake. As you can see, across the lake there are houses, and they're all up on stilts. It looks like we're in Florida, but we're thinking because it's prone to flooding. Which, the reason it floods is because Missouri River is like right over yeah, there. Yeah, it's like right behind those houses. Not right behind, but it's back off in there. Well, it does not look like a very clean lake, does it? No, it looks a little murky. Yeah, it's a little dirty. Yuck. Good for what? Fishing? Fish. We brought fishing poles too, so we might do some fishing. Swim at your own risk. Yeah, <laughs> Unacceptable bacteria levels. My gosh, do we have any water in Missouri that has good bacteria levels? Where is the boat ramp? Because there is supposed to be one. Sure don't look like it's down that way, does it? I don't know, the park office is down there. Oh, wow. Is that one way down there? Oh, that could be it way down there. 
Yeah, we will definitely have to drive to that then if we want to go down there to put our kayaks in. Yeah, so we can kayak in the bacteria. I don't know if you can see us over there. I'm like right in there. That's our spot. So as you can see, it's really shady, which is awesome. Look, it's a random bench. I gotta sit down and see what the view is. Hope it's not too hot. It's been sitting in the sun all day. It might burn my backside a little bit. Let's see what this looks like. Yeah, it's not bad. I see all them people's houses. I wonder if I should wave at them. I can't see any what's people. The, what's the name of that one uh, friends where they all watch the guy jump naked on the trampoline? Oh. <laughs> What do they call it? Ugly naked guy? Yeah. Yeah, okay. ugly naked guy. <laughs> well, you know, because I'm seeing all their windows all the ocean. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm sure at night you could probably see right into their little houses. Holy macaroni, that's a lot of rain. I think we're gonna get a storm. We beat that rain back to the campsite, but <laughs> I don't think we're gonna, I don't think it's gonna miss us. Look at all the tree thingies floating around. Looks like it's snowing out here. Oh, I feel rain already. A little misty. We went to the uh, Los, or I think that's how it's pronounced. Lost, Los, whatever, Bluffs National Wildlife Area. I got a few pictures. Did not video there because it's a national park and you know how I feel about all that. So, but you can go over to our Instagram and follow us over there and you'll get to see the pictures. They'll probably already have been posted by the time this video's out though. Whoa, man, that wind is really blowing strong. I would say look at Jesse's hair blowing, but. <laughs> it feels good though, doesn't it? It really cooled down a lot. It might be cooler out here now than it is in the camper with the air conditioner on. Kind of giving me chills. I would totally walk over to the lake and let you see all the waves, but no, because if it starts pouring down rain, I don't want to get so. Or yeah, I'll get struck by lightning. Wow! Let's get the microphone out so you can kind of get a real feel of the wind here. Big beautiful trees here. Hopefully they stay upright. Yeah, we want them to stay planted. We don't want them coming down. They look pretty healthy. So that's good. Oh, there's some more lightning. I don't know if I'm catching any of the lightning on video. Wow. What? I took it out. So they can hear the wind. Well, it's still thundering. Still a little bit of lightning. But we're out here fishing anyway. Because that's what we do. Haven't caught nothing yet. Jesse fell down. Missed it. Didn't get that on video. Slid right down the hill over there. <laughs> Are you okay? Yep. <laughs> Mm. Those clouds over there, the sky, that looks really pretty. Well, I was gonna try and video all the turtles, but there's a fish right there. Oh, and he may have just went under. Where'd he go? He's kind of just floating around there in a circle, it looks like. He must be 
in the bacteria water too long. Okay, well there. Let me see if I... Okay, do you see them little pokies? Let me see if I can get my finger up here. See, there's like a pokey there, a little pokey up over there. Those are all freaking turtles. There's a crap ton of turtles in this lake. That is so weird. I don't know if I've ever seen that many in a lake like this before. I mean, you always see some, but... There was a whole bunch. They were just like little heads popping up all over the place. So Jesse's saying that's why we're not catching any fish. They ate all the fish. They ate all the fish. Except for that one that I have video evidence of yeah. that was right there. That's a bummer. I wouldn't want to try to go down that hill. I just think we're going to kayak in that. I don't know. I'm water. debating this kayaking thing. Because <laughs> this water's kind of disgusting. I'm actually a little disappointed about this lake. I think it's kind of gross. Well, are we calling it or are we going to walk yeah. on down and see if we can find any other place nah, to fish? I'm calling for tonight. It's getting too late. There's too many possibilities of snakes. <laughs> no snakes. No snakes for you. It's raining again. It is so loud. It's like really large raindrops or something. And then it's really windy. Lots of thunder. Really hope this stops before tomorrow. I'm ready. Oh, shoot. Oh man, it's been too long. I forgot what it was like. Ugh, this water is so ugly. Gross. But it's nice and calm. That's cool. Ooh. And I don't, know, I don't really stink, so I mean I guess that's good too. around here if I can. you know just in case Jesse falls in maybe we'll get it on video well he didn't fall in he's got his fishing pole in case he finds a spot he wants to fish at Careful! <laughs> Are you off? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> ah, that's funny. I say we go that way because it looks prettier. See some turtles already? Oh, it is Turtle Cove. Yeah. There's probably a reason they named it that. I do not. Oh, yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. <laughs> like turtle heads everywhere. I doubt I caught, can catch that on the video, though, because they're pretty far over there. And they really just look like little sticks sticking out of the water. Can't really tell their heads.
there's a turtle coming right at us over here on the left side oh he just went under the water I think I might have caught his little head they are all over I wish you could see it I just don't know if you can see it their little heads just keep popping up and they look like sticks floating but they're like yeah they're everywhere Oh, there's one right, almost pointed directly in front of the nose of my boat. Oh, and he just went under. So this over here, this point, is actually another section of camping. It's all primitive. But you do get like a picnic table, fire ring, and a barbecue pit grill thing. So, and there's a little privy there. This, I believe, is still part of the state park. There's nobody over here. It's nice and quiet. It'd be really nice in the fall. Camp over here on this point. Yep, yep, yep. of talking it's a gorgeous Saturday morning the temperatures are absolutely perfect the sun is in the sky it's not raining and we are like the only people on this lake which normally I would say that's really awesome and we got really lucky but considering the signs <laughs> around the lake it makes me wonder if all these people are sitting in their houses watching us thinking oh those schmucks why are they on that nasty lake don't they watch the news haven't they heard the stories but surely if it was really that bad wouldn't they close the lake I don't know. I just feel a little weird. <laughs> I'm a little concerned. No, you're not glowing and it don't appear that you're growing another head, so I guess that's a good thing. Cabins there. Those or something that just opened up, I think Jesse said this year. Those are nice little cabins, so I don't know anything about them. I don't know how much they cost, but they're really nice. So if you want to rent a, rent a cabin, you could. There's a boat up there. We are not the only people on the lake. Whew. That makes me feel better. And if I turn around here, I'm going to spin ya. We got another boat coming in the water. 
as we speak. Seriously thought she was going to pull the truck into the water too. Ah, yay, she got it. <laughs> She's pretty happy. <laughs> Really? I didn't think it seemed that cold. Ugh, these biting flies are horrible. Ouch. I'm I'm videoing so if you fall in <laughs> It's kind of amusing just watching you get out of the boat. My turn. Over there. Oh, yeah. I see. Oh, thanks. Get some chicken. Oh, oh, oh. Yummy, yummy. How's the chicken coming along? Oh my, that looks really good. You know what I forgot to do? What? I forgot to video the asparagus. I forgot to video the rice. I forgot to video our pretty plates of food. So now the people not, didn't see anything but our chicken. It was really good. <laughs> Say hi, Madison. We have a couple of electronics in here, but we're going to do our best to get you guys back into nature. Kick the baby. <laughs> Don't kick the baby. Make a little swimming turtle. He's so tiny. His, his backside floats up. <laughs> that one's just laying there. Oh. oh! What is he eating? Is he supposed to eat that? <laughs> I guess it's dinner time. That's. I wasn't expecting that. Oh, wow. Yikes. Oh my gosh, she's so soft. I kind of videoed just a little bit of that just so that you guys kind of see that a lot of our state parks actually do stuff like this. Different types of things, activities that, you know, for families and kid, you know, lot, very kid, of course, oriented. But, you know, we were invited and we weren't the only older people there without children. So, Jesse didn't go. I don't know. He don't like stuff like that. But... I just thought it was kind of neat. I think it's cool that our, you know, state conservation and stuff, that I think it's cool that they put the time and effort into doing this stuff for kids, you know, for families and stuff. And different ones of our state parks will have different types of things. Not, I don't think all of them do it, but like this one, they have, this is like all summer long. It's like, was it like almost every Saturday, wasn't it? Throughout the whole summer I think like clear, I think it went clear up into like August or something you know so it's kind of neat and they even do it where if you which if you're not local obviously you wouldn't be able to probably participate in all of them but if you do so many of them the kids earn a little badge and you know this and that and so it's kind of cool but you know as you saw we got to watch a turtle eat or attempt to eat a <laughs> crawfish which was not expected but <laughs> Anyway, it was still kind of cool. Tell the people bye, Darby. You want to shake? You shake? Yeah. Bye. Whoa. Bye. Mm -hmm.